Hello everyone, this video is about the authentication failed with error code 403. So if you are receiving this while you are gaming, then I will show you how to fix this. So please follow the steps with me and let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do to stop the game that is running in the background. So to do that, right click on Windows Start button and open up your task manager. In here, you need to look for the Roblox game client and once you find it, just right click on it and select end task so once you're done close this and next we should use google dns on your keyboard press windows key and r to open up run and type in here ncpa.cpl and then just click ok over here choose the internet connection that you're working on so in my case i'm working on wi-fi so i'm just going to right click on wi-fi and select properties and next in here select internet protocol version 4 and click on properties then we need to select this option use the following dns server address and for preferred dns server type in there 8.8 .8, 8.8 and then for the bottom one which is alternative dns server type in there 8.8 4.4 also make sure to check this option validate settings upon exit just in case you have already selected this option in the past and it still is not working, then you can just choose the top one which says obtain DNS server address to my Glee, and just click OK. And next, close all this and open up your command prompt. So to open up the command prompt, just go to search and type in there CMD. And make sure you run the command prompt as an administrator. So just right click on it and select run as administrator. Type this command in the command prompt and press enter. So once you see this command successfully flash the DNS, just go ahead and close this one and open up run again by pressing Windows key and R. Type this one percentage local app data percentage and click OK. In here look for Roblox folder and delete it. And once you delete it, you need to restart your device. And after restarting, try to run the Roblox either from your browser or directly from your computer and hopefully it should be working fine and that's all by the way if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos thanks for watching